Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. How y'all doing? My name is Anne Lebutile. This is my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, please make sure to subscribe. Why have you not subscribed? Because I know you have binged. Like, I know you watch at least two, three of my videos. So subscribe. And after watching this one, go watch other ones that you haven't watched. So, if you're liking the vibe so far, subscribe, like, and share. Today's video is about confession slash Q&A. Um, because I am not the biggest person on social media. I don't have a lot of people bringing in confessions. So, I did get some from some of... So, from my sauces from sources which i will keep anonymous and then there are some q a questions that i received that i will respond to so it's like a, a confession slash q a we will see where it comes together but you'll get what you get what i mean so i wrote them down because the girl don't got a camera and the, they sent it to me on my phone so how am i going to read it and film at the same time because i don't have another phone unless if you guys want to send me money for a phone shop so cool the first one that i got um i did look through some of them i didn't really analyze them that much like i didn't really keep them like but i did like read through some of them so i kind of have an idea of what okay no but it, you get what i mean so i'm gonna answer one of the q a's first and then firstly and then go along with that and then one of them says um what keeps you going so i know that's kind of deep to stop with that one but what keeps me going is knowing who i am gonna be great in life like also what keeps me going is my family like knowing the the vision of wanting to be there for them and take care of them and like be there and them to see me succeed like me continuing like studying and me you know realizing my dreams and i want my mother to see that my family to see that so that keeps me motivated to just keep going and not like give up even though it, it's very hard school hopefully it will the pressure is getting western it's starting to make me contemplate now i have to reconsider now i have to contemplate if i really guys we can't drop out we want to we think about it but we can't because why we want to be rich how am i going to be rich unless if you guys give me 100 million are you going to give me no you will not so please please okay so okay one of the confessions <clears throat> this one shook me in this in this in this core in this core okay i mean the core but in this core this one when i, uh, I was like, uh, I was like, uh, I was like uh, yeah and then okay okay yeah yeah, I think it's safe to say I'm in love with one of your friends. Though I approach her, she kind of gave me mixed signals. I was frustrated. Then some girl asked if I need to talk. Then one thing led to another. And your friend's friends caught me in bed with that girl. And it kills me every time when I see your friend. Yeah, I know I'm a fuck up. Ah! And fun. Yo, yo, guys. Yeah, good tricky. So, like, I don't know what to say. Like, because it's saying he, he's in love with one of my friends. My friends. Like, which friend? Please tell me. Like, now I can't even ask. Which friend? And who about what they in the bath with another girl? Ah, what's up? <laughs> People, guys. Woo! Ha! friend's friend that that saw you in the pubs with that girl and why are you just going out here talking to people that you don't like and having them in the pubs <laughs> just to bambisa you are single you're just leveling leveling <laughs> Ooh, i okay i get the beginning like honestly i don't know what to say i don't know did you speechless and dinner with and uh, <laughs> and what oh, oh, that told me ah god like he wants my friends which friend i have so many friends like this is so, this is scary like i'm trying to think now which friend is he talking about and he's caught in bed in bed 
in bed way. <laughs> okay, guys, moving on, moving on, moving on. I don't want to make this long, but yeah, yeah, guys. Yay! It's a lot. It's a lot. The next confession. Let me read it. It's saying I'm in a relationship and I love being here. He loves me and I love him to death. He's literally he he lit. <laughs> I'd literally do anything for him, but there was a time when me and him broke up and he moved on with a girl and it hurt. So I needed to get back at him. So I had a thing with his best friend and we thought it was a mistake which happened. Or we thought it was a mistake which happened. So now it gets awkward when he asks me to come over. And his friend, his best friend is there. Yo, 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 <laughs> yo. <laughs> Woo, ah, uh ah. -uh. Like, this one is very weird. But, and he doesn't know. He doesn't need to know. Like, if no one tells him, he's not gonna die. Like, don't tell him if the friend hasn't told him just make sure you are you never go there when the friend is there like just ask is the friend gonna be there and then don't be there and also maybe talk to the friend and be like friend i know we had a thing nyana like for two weeks yeah like we we had a thing briefly and it, it was fun but please don't tell your friend because i love your friend and he loves me so why are we mixing things up why do people need to know things that they don't need to know <laughs> no i'm kidding i i would suggest you don't tell him but like if you want to tell him you can do that but i would say like just avoid the best friend like just make sure you you're not there when the friend is dead avoid awkwardness or just try to like not let it bother you so that he the best you the the guy that you are with doesn't notice okay Hosas who tricky who wow so that it's not mm, so it's not oh guys Uning. it's a lot it's a lot going on in this world but honestly i know to Yasha now you are saying it was a mistake and it's a mistake and he doesn't know why you want to tell him don't tell him <laughs> But also, you were broken up. Like reading this right now, you and that other guy were broken up. So it's fair game. Like you were not together. He went and got another girl. So ah, uh, why are you feeling bad? Don't feel bad. It's not even a mistake because you are single. Why are you feeling bad? You are single. You are single. Even if it was his best friend. You are single and he has another girl out there somewhere in the world so i don't think there's anything wrong with that initially i thought you guys were still together but reading this again i realized how mercy you broke up <sighs> so it's fair game lena if you want to be out there in the streets you are allowed to be there out there in the streets as well girl live your best life i'm probably giving you better advice Maybe you should listen to me because now nah, maybe I'm not giving you the best advice. Mara, I'm just saying you were not together at the time, so I feel like it's fair game. So, going on to the next one, we don't have a lot, but they are very juicy, they're very pretty. You know, I came on my way. It was also go after, go after you, who you know, you just want to, you know. <laughs> Okay, next one. I'm in love with my ex. Yeah! And I know he loves me too. We can never leave each other. So I have been with someone while me and him had broken up. And of course, it couldn't leave that. I couldn't leave that person just because my ex came back. So I've been dating both of them. So then the person cheated and it's nothing major. But it felt like a getaway for me to be with my ex. Finally, which is something I've wanted to do. But now that we broke up, I feel like I really grew to love him. I miss him. I want both of them again. Yeah. Yeah. 
yeah yeah it's a lot honestly but i feel okay in my opinion the advice that i would give you is to decide which one you love more because in the end you are going to be playing with two people's emotions and that's not fair to you or both of them and i think yes initially you broke up with your ex and then got with another guy rebound guy and then and then the guy cheated and then you wanted your ex back and your ex came back and then you were with your ex while you were with that guy so it was just like it's a lot it's a lot going on so i feel like initially your emotions were with you i feel like you only dated the other guy because you broke up with your ex so you were trying to like deal with that situation even though the ex probably not the best choice but like you were trying to deal with that situation so i think the best for me in my point of view i think you should like choose one and if you can't choose one then leave them both like because you'd be messing with two people's emotions and that's not gonna help anybody so guys that's all we have today thank you for watching I, if you enjoyed this video make sure to like subscribe it's your girl nazale sheng yeah! thank you for watching love you see you next time